Hi, I'm Melanie, and this is Tommy, and we're co-founders of Slingshot. At Slingshot, we take data from satellites, airplanes, and drones, and we extract insights at scale using some pretty advanced technology in the form of computer vision algorithms and uh, big data technologies in the back end. We're providing those insights at scale to companies that at one point had no access to space or, or aircraft or, or those uh, levels of uh, sensor capabilities. So Mel and I have both had various jobs in, in the U.S. Air Force, helping decision makers acquire the latest satellite imager or, or putting those to work on Air Force missions. There's, there's a massive amount of new satellites going on orbit, a massive amount of new data available, and with that data, data there's an opportunity to see change happening on a daily basis. And so we're just helping companies and agencies put that information to work um, by applying our technology and getting valuable information out of that data. When Hurricane Harvey hit, uh, Team BAE and Team Rubicon uh, gave us a call needing assistance in understanding the, the flooding and its severity. And we were able to, to turn our analytics machines on and our team came together to provide insights around the flood, the severity, uh, providing safe routes in and out of the, the flooded areas and um, providing staging areas for, for Team Rubicon. Work-life balance for us at Slingshot is pretty easy because we love our work and it's just part of our life, but we also try to help um, our, our team manage that. We give a one day a week to just kind of allow people to work from home if they want. We have a very flexible vacation policy where if you need the time off, it's understood that you need the time off and just take it when you need. We don't really track that. We chose Cross Campus in El Segundo for a number of reasons. One, it's a beautiful location. It's a creative space. It gives um, our employees a better work-life balance. <laughs> we have team members who like to go to the beach and surf, so um, it's a great location for that. You know, this uh, town, this city, has a great ecosystem for R&D prowess. Uh, the, the original Space Age was born just up the road, north of Grumman, planted the seeds by uh, opening up a, a campus atmosphere back in the 1960s that, that catalyzed you know, the Apollo program. 